Hey everybody, how's it going? In today's video I'm gonna show you how to replace the old batteries in Brown Series 5 hair clipper. This is HC5050 model, but it's gonna be the same process for the HC5010, HC5090 and the rest of the similar models. So let's get started. For this project you'll need a pair of pliers, a T7 Torx or a flat head screwdriver, plastic pry tool, soldering kit, and a proper set of batteries. You can also use regular AAA nickel metal hydride batteries. This southern kit and these batteries will cost you less than 20 bucks, which is way cheaper than buying a new clipper. I'll put the links to all the stuff in the description down below. So, first we need to remove these two screws. And then, using pliers, remove this metal bracket. Next, we need to pry open the case. You can use a plastic pry tool or a flat head screwdriver. Remove the internals from the case. Now, just open up these latches and remove the cover. Next, we need to remove the board, which is held in place by these latches. Push the latches to release the board, and then pull it out. Next, we need to desolder the batteries. Simply grab the battery with your fingers, like so, then apply outward pressure against the board and at the same time, melt the solder joint until the battery terminal lifts out on the hole. Now do the same thing for the other side, and then pull out the battery. Repeat this process for the other battery. Next, we need to remove the excess solder from the joints using a solder wick. You can also use a thin stranded copper cable. Now we can insert new batteries according to the polarity, like so. Next, we need to trim the leads. Then bend them over. Apply some flux and then solder them to the board. Once we're done, clean the board with rubbing alcohol. In case if you want to use regular AAA batteries, then you can simply remove these terminals and then solder them to the batteries. Ok, so finally let's put everything back together in the reverse order. Put the board into the case, then put the top cover in place and close the latches. Thank you. 
Put the whole thing into the case, then reattach the top cover, Place the metal bracket into its position and secure it with the screws. Don't forget to lubricate your clipper. I'll put the link to the soil in the description. And here's the difference in RPMs before and after placing the batteries. So I hope this was helpful and thank you for watching.